check your email. I think you might have a virus. Really, that you think? You think you're not positive your son didn't send you an email to improve your erection? <laughs> Why would I ever send my dad that text? Like, hey, dad, want a bigger dick? <laughs> Go fuck mom with me, click this link. Uh, also, I am a prince from Nigeria. And if you give me $1,000, I will give you millions, dad. <laughs> P.S. How's mom doing? <laughs> Sincerely, me. Yeah. Oh, I like that laugh. <laughs> um, I, uh, I uh, went uh, engagement ring shopping with my now fiance, and uh, before I went, <laughs> uh, um, but before I went, uh, people were like, "Hey, don't get the blood diamonds. Make sure you don't don't get blood diamonds." Yeah, if I was spending five thousand dollars on a rock. Somebody's got to die for that shit. <laughs> that should be a selling point for me personally. Um, 1.5 carats, princess cut, six dead Africans, right at the bottom. Thank you for stepping on the punchline. Um, <laughs> it's all good. Oh, okay, let's, uh... Oh, this is important. I feel like I'm interrupting the phone conversation. <laughs> That is very interesting. Um, so uh, I'm just gonna do this. Uh, I thank you. I appreciate that. Um, I I like people from the streets when they tell stories. I, I really enjoy it. Uh, I like the way they tell it. I like their stories. It's very interesting. Uh, I don't have that because I'm from the suburbs, so I can't tell street stories. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tell you a story that happened in my life, but I'm gonna say it as if I were from the streets. <laughs> this is something that happened a little while ago, and it happened to uh, my, me and my fiance, uh, who by the way I love to death, but here it goes. <laughs> the other day, me and my bitch <laughs> with the pottery bomb. <laughs> Cause you know a brother got to get some new placemats that will go great with my new silverware. <laughs> so I walk in and see the John. I was like, yeah, these place masks right here, now that's what's up. <laughs> then my girl walked up, talking about, I don't think we got the money for that. We just spent all that money on that Harry Potter DVD box set. I said, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you know I just got paid for two things. So you know I got that paper. <laughs> Called the salesman over. I was like, yo, man. I got this 20% off coupon. <laughs> he was like, I don't know if that works anymore. That might expire, but I can get the manager. I was like, yeah, nigga, do that. <laughs> <laughs> because I will put a motherfucking better business bureau in this bitch. <laughs> manager, come on. Talking about, you good, man. You can use that coupon. I was like, all right. Thanks for the assistance. <laughs> so I walk up to the checkout line, check out. Cashier talking about some. Have a great day, sir. I said, bitch, you have a great day too. <laughs> <laughs> and how do I do the acknowledgement? St. Jude's. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>